Simpson, the big play is an every Sunday occurrence. It's expected. His trophy case is full, but O.J. Simpson still dreams of playing in a Super Bowl. Last week, the reigning champion Pittsburgh Steelers had Buffalo pinned deep in its own territory. The fired-up Steeler defense threatened to take the momentum away from the Bills. Instead, the juice evaporated the vaunted Steeler defense's mystique. Simpson said he wanted to show a few folks just how fast he really was. A repeat of the play shows how O.J. got the opportunity. Anticipating the line plunge, safety man Glenn Edwards, cornerback J.T. Thomas, and all-pro corner linebacker Jack Ham bunched up in a short yardage defense. Ham and Edwards collided with one another trying to seal off the outside. Simpson capitalized on their over-anxiousness, beating Thomas to the sideline and setting the stage for a flat-out sprint to the end zone. On the day, the juice got loose for 227 yards, the most ever against the Steelers in the team's 43-year history. For O.J., it marked the fourth time he surpassed 200 yards rushing in a single game. The Buffalo offense amassed 434 total yards, 310 of it on the ground, the most yardage ever surrendered by a Chuck Knoll coach defense. Wide receiver Bob Chandler earned his flying wings this season after playing behind Ahmad Rashad and J.D. Hill in 1974. His precision patterns and deceptive speed add a new dimension to the Bills' attack. The offense once dominated by O.J. Simpson now shows depth and balance. With other new faces like Buffalo's number one pick in 1974, tight end Reuben Gant. Deservedly, on a day when neither its offense nor its defense did anything right, a Steelers special team provided the hometown fans with some excitement. Relief pitcher Joe Gillum rescued starter Terry Bradshaw in time to loft this touchdown pass to reserve tight end Randy Grossman. Gillum got his shot after starter Terry Bradshaw lost control of the Steeler offense and surrendered without a fight. Earl Edwards recovered Bradshaw's giveaway. During the course of the afternoon, the fired-up Bill defense forced several Steeler turnovers. And through it all, Bradshaw and Edwards saw quite a bit of each other. The frustrated right-hander just couldn't find the range, so he went to his short passing game. And one of those passes went to the fifth member of the backfield, Earl Edwards. Mike Kadish's touchdown scamper contributed to a 31-20 Buffalo victory. The win had been the Steelers' thrashing of the Bills in the 74 playoffs as head coach Lucy.